Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Medieval Engineers. Here we are for another episode. We're going to do another build. Um, I've done a lot of the other ones time lapse, and I figured I might um, do another one live with you guys. So we've got our farmhouse over here, our sawmill and logging camp up here. We've got our tavern, our most recent one. Our bakery. This is just like my little humble abode, I suppose. Um, our main storage um, town warehouse and our blacksmith up the top here have our mine entrance and stonemasons up the top and I have a mine, iron mine over this side as well. Um, as soon as we just did our tavern here, I'm going to do a winery, I think. Um, I don't know why that one's all bent, but I was going to do a winery through here. So I want to do like a winery um, storage area and then like a little house off to the side. So first of all, we should bring up our menu. So I've got um, stone bottoms, stone walls. I want to have, I want to have plank walls. I want, let's go um, these guys for the side. Okay, so once again, I want to sort of um, do our own sort of design. So I want to make it off the normal grid. There we go, so put that down. I'm going to make it, the entryway um, is going to be three wide. Um, I'm going to go one, two, three, let's go four, five back. I think it'd be a nice little, nice little size. I think I might get rid of this front part and put down I can find, there we go, old wooden support. I want to put wooden fronts on. So I've got plenty of stuff in the inventory. The only thing I don't have is logs. Um, but I've gone back through and traveled, cut down a whole heap of trees, made a whole heap of timbers, and all that sort of stuff. So, plenty of stuff. I've got logs. Full. We've got three full log storage at um, the town storage area, our town warehouse. We've got another two at our logging camp, plus timbers, plus planks, all that sort of stuff. So we've got plenty of stuff around for when we need it. Um, I'm going to go with wooden stairs here. going to get rid of that to put on some sloped rails. go it's like that and then I want to go and get rid of these again I want to put in some plank pillars just like that and try not to destroy things All right, so knock each of these guys in I'm sort of struggling a little bit at the moment the game is um, then I want to have another level above that, so level of flooring. Sort of trying to work out um, how it's all going to be. Right, like this, and then I'm going to have walls on top there. This is pretty much going to be the only little walkway, I suppose. The rest is just going to be just plain standard walls. I'm going to put a doorway in there because I want to have this to have access to um, a little house I'm going to put off to the side. So I think. Uh, let's get rid of that for now. We need to put in sticks. We don't have any sticks. Of course we don't. Um, I don't think I can make any because I don't have any logs. Nope. Alright, let's go. Travel down to here. Should be able to get some logs and make some sticks. That's one thing I forgot to pick up as well. I haven't made any sticks. As you can see, we've got full stockpiles in here, so got plenty of stuff available. Let's make some sticks there. Let's grab this guy. We can make some sticks too.
Oh, this guy obviously doesn't make anywhere near as much as the other one, but this takes one log to make 30 sticks. This is one log for 15 sticks. Alright. There we go. I might run back in and grab. Just. Let's go. I was going to say 10, but we can't get 10, so that'll do. Alright. Get back to the area that we're at, which is just here. And we'll put in our doorway. So I've got a, a rough idea as what I want to do um, design wise. I've usually always got something either in my head or something I've sort of drawn down. And like to go with um, those designs. Alright, so this is going to be, as I said, the storage area. And then we're going to have the house sort of off to the side. I don't think I'll um I don't think I'll fit the the house out um this episode. Um I usually try to when I'm sort of time lapsing, but it does take quite some time um to sort of design it and fit it out and that sort of stuff, so Probably not going to do it this episode. So that's all I'm going to do as far as the stone walls go. Then we're going to look at a roof. I'm going to do a wooden roof for the storage area. And then the house is going to have like a straw roof. So I might need to grab some more. Um, some more things we're going to need later on. So let's grab some stairs. I wish it would give me like where I want to put it, like here. But it won't let me put it there for some strange reason. All right. Well, well, how did it die from that? Really? Uh, all right. Death number one. Let's run down and grab our body. I st hate how we can't get the stairs in the spots we want them to be in. It really is frustrating. Um, let's grab some food. Where's our hammer? There it is. Thank God for that. Don't want to have to make another one of those. Alright, let's get rid of that. Get that. Let's see if that's going to allow us. There we go. It'll allow us to get up to here. Um, as far as this goes. want this to be clay. Of course we need clay. Um, number 8. Timber with shutters. Let's go number 5. Um, I hate this. Unless you're in the right spot, it doesn't want to rotate properly. Number 4. I can't remember what the top one was, doesn't matter. That. So we just need some clay now. And then this other end is going to have to sort of be the same. Like this. And we're going to have to go um, number four. Actually, it was a window, wasn't it? That'll do. Um, actually, that's not what I wanted. Why did I put it up so high? There we go. Um, the wall there. This is completely different to the other end. Number six on top. There we go. Um, let's go and grab some clay. I've got heaps of clay over here. I thought I had some on me, but I must have lost it somewhere full stockpiles of timbers and planks so I can't even drop off some some planks or anything but that'll work plenty of clay now all right let's go up here get this side done 
first. Should be able to climb. Whoops. Climb up here. Can we? There we go. We can hit that one too. Good. Okay, like that. Let's get rid of this and go. Uh, wooden roof. So number four. Throw our roof the whole way along. Um, one thing I have done is I've turned off structural integrity um, because it was just frustrating. Like I don't understand he how um, parts of the the walls and stuff can just sort of collapse randomly. It really doesn't make sense sometimes or some of the things that start to collapse. So decided against um, using it. Go to there, we'll put our top on. Like that. Alright, and I'm going to build um, inside like a big storage area for some barrels and stuff to store um, the wine and the hops and all that sort of stuff. So, like that there. Knock those down, knock that down as well. Climb, we're going to build these stairs, I think. Um, yeah, I want permanent stairs, but I don't know. I don't know if I want to use those stairs or not. So, why is that one fully built and that one's not? Make sure everything's built in properly. Go shut this window. Um, get rid of the roofing stuff. I want to put handrails up along here so we don't fall down. I think I do want to get rid of that. And let's hope that we can get these stairs. I don't know why does not want me to put it where I want it to go. It really is extremely painful. All I can do is put that there, grab um, another floor there, that's the right way, like that, there we go, um, and then put a handrail We want to get rid of these guys, put in the handrail on this side. Awesome. That'll do, I suppose. Um, not sort of how I want it to look, but I think that's what we're going to have to go with. Um, let me have a look at that. Let's... those guys in. A bit of structural integrity, not that it really matters too much, but uh, where are we? No, I want it to be this level. So what I want to do now is go outside. Uh, actually, we probably could run up to here. Get rid of you. Uh, where is not the bed? This guy. Crafting table. To here, I want to go make as many of those as I can. Let's clear that out. I want to grab um, timbers, I want to grab planks, and these guys. This is going to give me um, somewhere to store all our crops and stuff from outside. That'll do for now. Let's have a look at the barrels. So I think if I put one here and go three wide, let's have a look at um, timbers. What sort of level is that? Let's go level so five high timbers.
There we go. And then... Let's go this way. We'll just go maximum width. Try and get all the way to the other end. This is going to be our like our barrel storage area, of course. I think go six. Probably shouldn't be able to see it from the outside. Right, so number four. Right there. I think it'll be there. And a five and a there. So one, two, three, four, five, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's pretty close. Might be able to get an extra barrel in that side. Let's go back up here and grab these other ones. Make some more while we're there. Um, Alright, so I want to put in like, cross beams in here as well. Let's go number four. Can we get. Yeah, that should be alright. Get all those guys in there. And then I think. I don't think we need to go any higher. Um. Definitely going to need to get up on top. Let's make another full amount again. Going to need to get up on top to put down some some boards and stuff. So let's put in some stairs here, just so I can organise these guys. So planks, uh, not like that. This the whole way along. I think I need to hit that out of the way. Still. Alright, we'll hit you out of the way then. Ah, uh, okay. There. All sorts of out of whack, those ones. Alright, so a full row. Barrels there. Come back up to here and take all of you. Let's go another lot. Do we have any torches? We do have got torches on us. I don't know how many we've got, but uh, let's put a torch here and a torch there. Just brighten the room up a little bit. Can't actually get on top of there now, but I don't know if you yeah, probably will actually need to. Right, let's just have a look at these barrels again now. So, actually, yeah, that's going to be not how we need it to be because we're not going to be able to put barrels on it. I think I know what I need to do, but we're just going to have to clear all these out now. Still puts um, the planks in, but we need to turn them up the other way and have them in a different way, like this. In like that, and then in again like that. Oop, bit of lag. Right, like that, let's go. Can we put them in here? That's going to be the question. Right, like this, there we go. Now that's going to be a lot better than what we were going to do before, so let's 
Start placing these guys down. Alright, we can obviously put a lot more down than what we had before. I don't know if that's touching. I don't think it is. Need we have still got an extra barrel. Um, all right, let's put just a couple sort of over here out of the way. There we go. Knock you down. So they should. Let's grab the grapes. So I did put a whole heap of these guys outside ready to go. Throw all the grapes in there. Can't get all of them now because we've got a barrel in inventory. Alright, number four. Uh, four, there we go. Done. Let's grab you. And then we've got the hops as well. Just you there by yourself. The hops we can put up the other end. So you can see we're going to have plenty of room for storage in here. Can't get that one yet. I think I've even got more in um, those other storage containers too. The sun's starting to go down. Already, which is annoying. Um, you get more grapes, more hops. Whoop, bit of lag. Alright, let's go. Sort of even these out a little bit. Probably focus more on grapes than the actual hops, so let's go. All the way to there, with the grapes and the rest from the right hand side down can be um, the hops. Right, there we go. Let's. Why did that not go in? There we go. Hops and hops all through here as well. We've still got more barrels in their inventory. Get rid of you, go back out, should be able to grab the rest of these hops. This has just got random stuff in it that I chucked in it out of my inventory to be able to fill, fill things back up a little bit more. Um, Alright, there we go. Fill that up with hops, so that's all hops, wine, and we've just got extra storage. Um, sort of over there, let's just put some through here as well. Um, I don't think I'm going to do anything else in here. That, we'll leave it up to the tavern to brew it and that sort of stuff, but I think that um, that's really all we need to do in here. It is just a storage area, so not much else needs to be done as far as the storage into here. Um, anything I would probably probably would look at would be uh, let's do something like this something like that and then if we can the same one that's the same side like that and then Here as well. This is sort of. Oh god. Can you hit the body thing? There we go, thank you. Don't know if we'll be able to reach it from down here. Definitely not. Oh, looks like another couple more ladders. Can we reach that one? I don't think we can. 
run along these barrels will be right. Probably doesn't make much of a difference, but it sort of just helps fill in the room a little bit and make it look a bit more storagey. All right, so there we go. Nice little winery storage area. Come out the front, got like a nice little um, deck area as well. I do think. Uh, where are we? Come along the front here. Fill these bits in. It's annoying now that it's starting to get dark as well. That's a little bit frustrating. Right, so there we go. That's like the tavern storage area, or the storage area. Should we... I don't know if I should... I think we probably should run these guys like along here. Because it never seems to like fully seal. Which is a little bit annoying. Let's go this way. Okay, that did hit in. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Let me grab some flooring. It's another good thing about not having structural integrity. You can actually do stuff like this without risking bringing a whole wall down. I think that sort of just fills it in a little bit better. Alright, bring this guy back to here. Alright, get these guys in. Okay, beautiful. Alright, so now let's get rid of this. I want to go with the uh, old school flooring. Um, I want to go with door, windows, walls, all the other sort of stuff. And then I want to do a thatch roof, but I don't know. Thatch. Let's go roll. I think we have to do it in an inventory, maybe. Roll of thatch. I think we should better make a little bit. So good. Alright, so come to here. I want to put in um, a house, so I think something like that. One, two, three, four. Think is that long enough, or should we come out a little bit further? Something like that, I think that'll do. So I haven't really designed this part of the house yet. Um, everything else I've sort of, well, that that part I had designed in my head, but this side I haven't had it designed as yet. I do like using these floors because it already has the wooden boards on it. So you don't have to put extra flooring down and use a heap of planks. Alright, so there we go. It's that done. Now I want to have a look. I think... Plank door there. Let's go. Window there. Window there. Let's have... Few windows here, let's go like that. Right, let's knock all these guys in. I said I sort of haven't really designed this in my head, I just sort of knew roughly what I wanted things to look like. There's a timer going off already, I haven't even started the vineyards out the back yet. So I might need to do that off camera or at least just do a 
tiny little bit. Ah, that's all done. Okay, so I just want standard walls all the way along here. No, not there, but we'll fix that up in a minute. I need to make some torches too because it's quite dark already. Probably should have skipped through the day. Um, started a fresh day before I started building, but I thought it was only still early morning, but obviously not. Alright, now it's going to be interesting trying to um, get this roof to work as well. I sort of do know what I want to do as far as the roof goes, but it's just a matter of getting it to work. I hate having the windows and everything open. Uh, let's come over to here and go wall torch. Make as many of those as we can. Go roll. Thatch. I'll take you. Um, knock you out. Gonna need to get rid of this and put in some stairs here as well. Okay, you won't let me do that because that's in the way. Is that the only reason why, or is there another reason why? I don't know. Alright, well, we can actually put in. Now for some reason, it does not want me to. Yeah, now I can. That is weird. May have something to do with the door, but it shouldn't. Now I can. Oops. Now I can put it in. Right, that's weird. Right, take those. Let's get rid of all this stuff, and now I can bring that back up when we need it. Get some wall torches. torch in, in a few inside as well. Just to help brighten it up a little bit. I don't know if it's still bright enough for you guys, but hopefully it is. Right, so as far as the roofing goes, alright, like that. that and we need to go like that that one doesn't really need to go there yet because we need to turn it the other way all right I hope we have enough thatch to cover it we should have It's only one roll of thatch per roofing component, so you should have enough. Right, there we go, and we need to grab number eight again. Uh, no, where's it? There it is. In a corner. We need the number nine. That one, and then straight along. And that one, I think that's right. Let's bring in another set of stairs. Get that one, knock them down again. Put that up, there we go. That's pretty much how it's going to look. What does it look like from the outside? That corner is weird. What is the go with that corner? Don't know why. That completely, that completely got rid of that then. That's weird. 
one hit shouldn't get rid of it completely. There we go, let's go back out and have a look. Uh, still not perfect, like the roof is still weird in certain spots, but I think that'll do for now. Um, let's bring this guy up. Gonna put just some of these guys along. Just to make it sort of fill it in a little bit better. And that means I'm gonna have to put one there as well. Don't know what that's gonna look like on the outside, but it's got heaps of timbers on us, over a thousand timbers. Been pretty busy up at the sawmill. Right, knock all these guys in and then we'll have a look at what it looks like on the outside. It doesn't look too bad. Um, probably do with a torch there. And the main torch there. We don't need torches sort of around here, but we could probably do with um, some bushes and stuff to stop people from be able, being able to look in. Um, so this is, of course, going to be like our main walkway through to... The other part, um, or the storage area, I should say. Um, get those in. Give me this. Like that. Knock that in. So we could probably turn uh, this area in there into like the kitchen area. Um, come in the main door. Let's go. You there, and a wall, and a wall. We're hungry. Um, that torch, can we get it back out? No. Alright, knocked you back in. Like that, so this could be like the bedroom, I suppose. Coming to here, it could be like the uh, formal living area. Let's go and knock that in. This could be like the little bathroom, which I just have to get the toilet to put in there, but bedroom. Uh, is that the, that's the right side? Beautiful. Yeah, all right, knock these in. I'm not going to worry about the pointy bit up top. Sort of let a bit of air flow through. Um, probably don't want air flow from the uh, toilet, I suppose. Like that, there we go. So this can be the toilet, this can be like the main lounge, dining, whatever, kitchen, bathroom, uh, bedroom. It comes through to obviously the work area, the storage area, and then we don't actually have a, actually let's knock this out, we probably need a door out here to get out to where, to where the vineyard is obviously going to be, so knock that in, beautiful, so as far as the vineyard goes, like I did have an idea of how I wanted it to, to get set up. Um, so we are running out of time um, for me to do what I want to do. I think, let's go to here, let's go uh, there to there, let's get rid of those. Uh, where are all our seeds? I had seeds everywhere. I don't know where I put them now. 
Um, but not here. I might have... I thought I had heaps of seeds. Maybe I haven't done the seeds yet. Um, I've got this guy compressing some grape juice. Um, nope, no seeds in there. Just throwing some grape seeds there. Um, this guy I had making some um, hops, or some malt I should say, so we can make some beer. This guy is just making whatever it wanted to, really. Um, alright. You there. Let's go grab seeds. Done. Let's go back to where we were. I'm just going to do one row of um, grapes and you guys will sort of see what my plan was. So if I... Um, start a row here. I sort of wanted to make sure I kept everything straight. So this is this isn't gonna stay, this is sort of just my my guide to make sure I'm in the right spot planting things straight up and down. Right, and it's gonna go it's gonna be a fairly big winery as you can see. I think that might do, so let's uh, go like that. Now if we go number seven, I don't know if I have... yeah let's make this, let's make a torch. Is that gonna help? Can I use that? I can't use that with the plow anyway. Of course I can't. Um, Alright, so let's go straight this way. I know it's hard for you guys to see, and I do apologise. We will need to get some more wall torches sorted out. And get some put outside. So this will be... Um, maybe four or five... Six... I don't know, rows of uh, grapes and stuff. And then after that we can look at um, doing the hops. Right, there we go. So now, if I just run back and keep pressing the button, we should just get like a proper row. Proper row of grapes, hopefully. probably bring our um, plough over and plough the whole thing for one big go, but yeah, that's not straight at all. Here I am following my footsteps, thinking I was following the right line, and obviously I wasn't. But I think you guys get the idea. So knock all this down and then we'll have a quick look. So just be a few rows of grapes. Um, I mean, these things may never, may never even be harvested because we've got plenty of grapes inside. But it's there just in case you want to um, throw like another four or five rows of grapes and do a few rows of grapes here. But um, um, what, I, what other thing I want to do quickly? I'm go hazel seeds. Um, these things are what I've started using, sort of as something I can use instead of a fence to sort of block off. Um, see how these guys go? They might block the road a little bit to block off people being able to get in. To like our winery, so I'm sort of using fences because the fences sort of aren't um, aren't ideal. So now if I just we need some more, we're going to need more than that as well. Uh, 
six. Right, just do a fair run down. Like I said this is just an easier way for me to block off areas instead of um, putting in fences. The fences don't look anywhere near as good as they could, I don't think. And um, yeah, it's just a whole heap easier. But there should be a road here somewhere. Uh, maybe not. That's gone way too far. We sort of only need to bring it over to here and back around. Thought I did build a road. Thought I did build a road from out the back here, but maybe I didn't. So there's the fence there, and here's the plow. Probably need to bring that over, but I'm going to have to knock those guys down to bring it over and um, get it all done. So if we go, say, from here and run straight across this way we should be able to get them to join up so just putting in random distances apart a little bit of lag still auto saves and stuff Hopefully we've got enough on us, otherwise we're going to have to make some more seed bags. Nope, don't have enough. Let's grab just a couple more and hopefully that'll be enough. Yep, here we go. That's it there, so that's sort of going to be our, our area, I guess. Let's get rid of all these herbs out of the way and stuff. So, um, yeah, that's going to be our little winery and our storage area. As you guys can see here. So it's going to be our main path through the back of the tavern. I've sort of put these in for the fence as well. So this fence will probably run, I don't know, down to here and then across. Because I'm going to put some more of these hops um, at the back of the tavern too, I suppose. Or maybe even just like through to here and then put in some houses and all that sort of stuff in the centre here. But... You guys sort of let me know what you think of this build and what you think we should do in the future if you've got any ideas and all that sort of stuff. If you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed guys, please do so. It's me Bruno, thanks for watching. See you again soon.